talk about. I'm, I'm coming back from the car show in Springfield, uh, Illinois. Uh, so, Friday night, uh, I guess I'll talk about what HPJ did to fix my car, um, how Friday night went at the drag strip, what happened Saturday night, and then today. Um, so, uh, you guys know the last few times I've been at the drag strip, uh, in March, before my trans kind of took a second shit, uh, I was in the burnout box doing a hit, and by the 600 foot mark, I was DOA. Basically, my car would shut down, I would blow a fuse 42, and that would be it. Uh, I thought maybe it was just a freak thing. Uh, trans blue, so I didn't really get a chance to drag race again. In, uh, in April, it, it was out, I missed NMRA, and then I got the car back at the end of May. I broke in the transmission. You guys didn't know I went to Mustang Week. Uh, fast forward a little more. Three weeks ago, I was at, at our local drag strip. Burnout box, hit the, the, the traps, the lights, boom. Halfway down, 600 foot mark, dash lights up and problems. So I got a hold of the owner of HPJ. I explained to him what's going on. He said, replace the fuse, try it one more time. Let's see what happens. Did that, same thing. And did it again, same thing. So I knew it was something at the drag strip. The following day, I went down to Hall Street and uh, did some racing there. And I had no problems. It, it didn't do any of that. The only thing was I didn't do a burnout, I just did a hit. And that's the only difference. So I bring the car to HBJ. I tell Mike what's going on. Mike does his stuff. He's got a guy, great there, that guy that figured it out. Um, so the wiring harness from the fuse box into the cabin of the car, since my engine is lowered about a half inch, was rubbing up against the, the K member and just kind of shaving off the casings of the wire and basically caused it to ground out. So that was, that's why this car was shutting down. Uh, so I ran uh, basically 311 flats on eight pounds of boost, leaving softly. Just wanted to do a burnout just to see how it feels. And I, I did good. I had a passenger in my car each time. So I'm sure with a passenger, I would have cut off a 10th or two. So it was definitely running, you know, good. I have no problems the way it was running. I was trapping 130 miles an hour. So the mile per hour is there on eight pounds of boost. So I will be switching back to my kill pulley next time I'm at Cape Bay. So that there is pretty much what leads me to my my next thing. Let's go ahead and start a thing on that. Um, so Hall Street was a bust. The last few weeks I've been going, it's been great. And I, this leads me back to spectators are fucking up the street scene. Uh, and it's the people like me that have a, a car that they want to race, that's built, that, that can do it, goes down there, minds their own business, doesn't block any businesses out or in, and generally gives respect to the businesses that were there. I have now seen countless times where people in cars that are not racing, they're just there to show and spectate. The people running the thing down there, there's several people with flashlights and trying to direct traffic down there, trying to direct where people are going. They'll park willy-nilly wherever the fuck they want. And what happens is they block in the business and security gets pissed and just calls the cops. So this happened last night. And not only once, but twice. And they are killing the good spots that we have. Now, every time we go, it's good for a few weeks. And these dickheads, these fucking spectators, they're not racing. They're not with somebody that's racing. Just driving down there and they just fuck everything up. Uh, maybe it's just me bitching about it. Maybe it's just me, uh, you know, just aggravated by it. But every fucking time. This happened at our Earth spot. This happens now at Hall Street. This happens in South County. And this fucking now happens out at Goldman and 21. Yes, I know I'm giving these spots away. I probably shouldn't. I should edit these videos, but... I probably might do that in post or pre or whatever. You know what I mean. I guess it'll be post production would be after. But anyway, I think that's the issue. I think we've got too many fucking spectators that are coming out in their fucking mom's minivan. They want to watch a drag race and they don't want to go to like the local drag spots, like you know, Gateway, and watch a drag race there. They want to come out to the local fucking street spots and spectate and just get in the fucking way. And I think that's what's starting to kill this scene. I mean, if you think I'm right, say something. If you think I'm wrong, say something. But I think that's the problem. I think the street scenes 
And I'm guessing this is happening across the country, not just here, but across the country. Uh, and I think that's what's going on. I'm also starting to see a lot of undercover cops. You guys need to be careful doing this shit, man. If you don't know somebody and you've never seen somebody and no one can verify that guy, don't race them. I've already started to hear about people racing Chargers and Mustangs and Hellcats out here, getting videotaped, going back to the meat spots, and then getting arrested because they raced somewhere they didn't know. Keep that in mind, guys. I'm not advocating for street racing, but keep that shit in mind. They're out here trying to screw with you. Uh, the economy's starting to go south, so that means that, you know, police officers have to justify why they're getting their budget. It means they're going to look to start pulling you over. And I know you tell me, oh, I'll just fucking run. Well, that, that's nice. Then you kill somebody, and then you're looking at a lot of fucking time. So, just keep that in mind. Uh, let's see. The last thing I guess I could talk about would be uh, the car show. Uh, I I did enjoy the car show. There's a lot more people down here. Um, I did win gold for my class. I guess I guess that's kind of fucking cool. Um, it was me and a few other Shelbys out here, and I won gold. I won the top thing, so that's pretty good. Uh, I puckered my ass a little bit. It is fucking downpouring in Springfield. And I guess the camera might be able to pick up the black sky. And that way it's been lightning and thundering. But the camera, or the camera, the phone is telling me that as long as I'm heading south on 55, I shouldn't encounter any rain. It's just going to be over to the right of me and behind me. So, and it's not supposed to start storming in St. Louis for another three hours. It takes me about an hour and a half to get from where I'm at. So... Hopefully uh, that goes off well. Um, met a lot of nice people. Met a bunch of new people that I really liked. Had a good time. Uh, so hopefully uh, those friendships continue to grow. I mean, I don't go out there to win prizes. I go out there to talk to people and see what's going on. Uh, meet some of the street people. There are definitely people there that street race there. Um, a lot more, uh, you know, first gen coyotes out there with blowers. Uh, a lot of other cars out there that I can tell were definitely street cars. Uh, and they're definitely doing racing out there because they asked me if, if I ever came out there and raced. And I'm like, it's a little too far for me. An hour and a half to two hours to do some street hooting is a tad bit too far for me. Unless I'm visiting that area for a few days with a bunch of friends. I just, I wouldn't travel out there. It's just not what I would do to, you know, go out there one night to street race. To drive two hours, to do an hour of racing and then two hours back. I, I just wouldn't do it. Um, but, yeah, uh, so far so good. Uh, yeah, I met a lot of people, a lot of cool, interesting uh, individuals, some nice cars. Uh, I did have a good time. Uh, so that's pretty much my video. Uh, I'll get this posted. I've got some racing video. I've got some other things I need to post up. Uh, I'm going to try to get that out tonight and uh, go from there. Uh, talk to you guys later. Enjoy. I'm going to turn this off now.